Council will begin its weekly meeting on the docket. An ordinance raising the maximum height of certain buildings and expanding trails throughout downtown. Fox 55 Choice Grant is live at Citizen Square, where the meeting is set to start at 530. Choice, how much is this urban trail expansion going to cost? Who's paying for it? Tara Bryan, $1.8 million is going to expand the urban trail system. Most of this money is coming from the American Rescue Plan Act, also known as ARPA. Now the city wants to spend $1.2 million of that federal COVID relief money and put up $600,000 to just to make it easier to get around town without a car. Ken Castleman is the executive director of Fort Wayne Trails. He says this is a step in the right direction. Urban trail is a redesign of what we'd traditionally see where you'd see a street and a sidewalk. It would allow for the sidewalk infrastructure to be a lot wider, allowing for trail users to either ride their bikes or walkers or runners to have space on that stretch as well. And the traditional sidewalk, of course, would be there for access to the existing commercial corridors and infrastructure. But it really is about connectivity. Since the city is using majority of ARPA funds, residents' taxes should not be impacted. The trail is envisioned to be a multi-use pathway between the sidewalk and the street. Now, this is just being introduced tonight. The meeting doesn't start off for another half an hour, so nothing is set in stone just yet. But if all goes according to plan, it could be passed as early as next week. In the next hour, I'll have a live look from the meeting. Reporting at Citizen Square, Troyce Grant, Fox 55 News.